for the joyous moment when you officially be Mom, what did you say? <laughs> oh, what's your soul saying? Are done virtually January 24th, 2024 at 2.30 p.m. I am so excited. So we finally got to the point where we got a date for Jamie's name change slash adoption. I guess it's not, so it's not like an, a formal official adoption, but she is changing her last name to Pettit and Jamie wants it to be treated just like an adoption. So over the last couple weeks, she's like, so what are our adoption t-shirts gonna look like? What is this gonna look like? So I'm not trying to click me, any of you, if you hear me call it adoption, that is why Jamie really wants it. And we're all considering it like her adoption date. Like we're gonna celebrate it as her adoption. So, yeah. yay, we finally got a date. We are going to surprise her today with that date. So we've been going over different ideas and different things, different ways to surprise her. And what did we come up with? Um, well, Bella actually has the really amazing idea. We're gonna go to Build-A-Bear, we're gonna get a Baby Yoda, because that's her favorite Disney character, and then you're able to put like a message in the uh, stuffed animal. So we're gonna put her adoption date and in the voice be like, thing. You're gonna be a Patty on January 24th, 20. Oh, 20, 124, 24. That's such a cool thing. That's that's a lucky number. That's that a cool. Lucky. So, okay, let's go do it. We found him. Found him, we may. I don't know. He always uses this weird. Grogu. Yeah, what does he say? What would he say? Um, he, doesn't he doesn't really doesn't talk. talk. Oh. Yeah. He has a, a robot that says Yoda yes, talk. yes. Oh, why do you think of Yoda? I think they might be out though. Do or do not. There is no trouble. That's what it was. Okay, that'll be sad if there's no Yoda. We gotta find Yoda. Baby Yoda, Grogu. We're allowed to take, We're allowed to take the display? Yes. yes. He said just grab But will we be able to put a thing in it? You have these little things that go inside the bear, and we're gonna record our voice and then put it into the bear. I just don't know what we should record, like what are we say. We can't wait for the joyous moment when you officially become a pet it on January 24th of 2024. We can't wait for the joyous moment when you officially become a pet it on January 24th of 2024. That's good. We're gonna try to find like a cute dress or something. It's a girl, kind of makes sense. Oh, a little baby Yoda outfit. Okay, that's pretty. So it's a little baby Yoda Christmas onesie. And then the Yo the baby Yoda slippers. Why is everything that like we're needing the last one? So I literally have to take the display off. What happens if you add Grogu's ear to Grogu? Does he become double Grogu? Does it become super grogu? I don't know. The light is still spinning around inside my head. You know it's you that lit, lit the spark that's there inside. I just wish that I could live it all again. You're in my heart and soul. You turn those dark days. I want to look in Pandora. Sometimes they have little charm necklaces that you can put together. And I'm going to see if they have one that like fits this like You're in my heart and soul. My heart and soul. Eric made pretzels the other day. And now he's obsessed. And he's like, can we go stand outside of Wetzel Pretzel and see how they twist the pretzels together? I mean, we can. It's not the twisting part, but I want to figure out how they like set their dough so that it's like the right shape and the right size. Do you want to go watch them real quick? I might. Okay. I did end up finding a necklace for Jamie, and I have to go to the other Pandora though because they don't do it at this one. But they will engrave her name and her uh, adoption name change date on it. So 
So I thought that was really cute, but we'd have to go to a different mall to get it in drink. But before we leave, there's a place called Shields that we've never been into before. And it's a new... She got distracted. I know they're so on my list. cute. They're on my Christmas list. Okay. Squirrel. Your Christmas list. Squirrel. <laughs> Put it on the list. Anyway, Shields what? Anyways, there's a Shields, which is like... I don't even know what it is, but it was all over everything and every advertisement I've seen lately. So we're gonna go check it out. When is it opening? I don't know. They have a pixel playground. It's like a selfie world. Closed moving locations. What? It looks so cute. There's I wonder where they're moving to. Small child and he's like, I bet I could put my hand through it. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing that I got too big an arm there. Okay, here is Shields. What is this? Does anybody know? Shields is a proud partner of the Arizona Cardinals. It's like okay, but a what is mega it? sporting goods store. It's like the what Bass Pro is to like camping and stuff like that. This is to sporting goods. Bass Pro mixed with a Dick Sporting Goods? Yes. It's, oh. Yeah. But it is employee owned. But it's employee owned? It, yeah, it's similar to Winco. Oh. Winco or REI. Yeah. Oh, look at the little Dick sweater. Why is that so cute? Can I buy the boxes? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think they're for sale? Probably not. Just decoration. Look, they have video games in here. They have a big Ferris wheel. This is huge. <gasps> look at the dinosaur over there. What the heck? There's a Ferris wheel? And look at the dinosaur. There's a home okay. decor section, Crystal. That's the good. There's dinosaurs. There's a home decor section. There's video There's games. There's an arcade. There's sporting goods. There's a Ferris wheel. I like this store. <laughs> this is a really cool store. Look at this Oh, softball stuff. Bella is doing softball this year. She was debating with school and all the stuff she had going on. But she did decide she's going to try out for the team. So, yay. They have these puzzle pieces on the wall. And then you can basically build your own picture frame out of all of the pieces. I told her to just wait. I am going to wait. I'm going to wait because it's not for Christmas. But I want to do this on one of the walls in the house coming soon because it's such a cute idea. I love it. <laughs> it was a trust fall. It was a trust fall. We are not meant for the little pictures. Aaron, you're noisy walking. So we're going back to Pandora to get it engraved and I'm really excited to surprise her and I can't wait to see her reaction. Here's what I was thinking. We're gonna make dinner together and then when we're sitting down tonight for family dinner, then we're gonna do the surprise. And, and then we'll go around the table and say something that we love or yeah, yeah, you get it. Okay, so we're gonna do breakfast for dinner though. So we're gonna do French toast sticks, not French toast sticks, French toast, actually we could cut them in sticks. It's a good idea. Uh, and then bacon and fruit and you know, just do breakfast for dinner. The other thing though is Aurora has cheer tonight and then um, Arwen and Logan have a band concert. Did you practice? Did you know all the notes? Yep. Yeah. It's a really nice day living in the right space. Breathing your best, got me feeling so kind of way. Yeah, you're keeping me sane, got me in my right brain. So I do, <laughs> I don't know if this is accurate either, but I do one second per egg that I put in. I so if I put like eight eggs, I'm like, but I count it fast eight seconds. Someone told me that in my childhood and I carried it on. Like and you gotta do cinnamon. You wanna shake it in? Sprinkle, yeah. sprinkle. Yeah. Oh, don't touch the egg. You gotta keep it high. Okay, you wanna hear the trick with it? You go like this. So to make the make enough French toast for our family, we go through two loaves of bread. You and me, let's fly away. So when we went to 
cut up the fruit, there was a little bit of mold on it. And so Max ran to the store to get fresh fruit real quick and he's not quite back. And then I didn't realize someone had eaten the bacon earlier today. <laughs> so <laughs> we have French toast, um, but we will have fruit when they get home in just a little bit. Today is a very special day for Jamie, guys. So, can we go around and tell Jamie your favorite memory of her? She's like, why is it special? <laughs> why do you think it's special? I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? Because you look beautiful? <laughs> she does look beautiful. No, I did get you a surprise. I got you an early Christmas present. So, well, I'll give it to you in just a minute, okay? My favorite memory, well, I have like, I don't have one specific, but I just, I loved when we lived together because I feel like we got along so well. I loved like whenever we'd make dinner together, watch movies, go out. I don't know, I just, I feel like when we lived together, we had a lot of fun, so. My favorite thing about Jamie is her hugs and her compliments. I think Savannah makes a great point. Jamie gives amazing hugs. I think my favorite memory with her was when we went to see um, The Lion King. The musical yeah. that was so much fun right yeah and anytime we hung out or went shopping together yeah i just i love hanging out with you jamie me too when we went to the butterfly place and, um we were talking my favorite memory with her is playing june's journey together I, I have a ton of favorite memories with jamie there's been so many good times that we've gone through but my favorite thing about jamie is when jamie sings when Jamie sings, you can know that Jamie's having a good day. And it's her way of expressing just how she's feeling. And she doesn't care, you know, what anybody's around doing. She just absolutely lives in that moment singing for herself and, you know, putting on her concert. And I just love you know, her peace and her serenity. And I, I think it's something that we all need to learn to you know, let ourselves go a little bit and enjoy ourselves and stop stressing, you know, what other people are thinking or, or whatnot. And so she's my hero when it comes to that because I wish I was more like her. I have so many favorite memories with Jamie. Like I could go on and on, but one of my absolute favorite ones, and I think about it often, was the first time that we went to Disneyland together. And Jamie, is like the definition of the magic at Disney. So when we walked in and she saw the characters and she sees, and she got to talk to Cinderella and about losing her shoe and she just like got so excited in this light in Jamie's eyes. Like, and we had actually only known each other for about, I think two weeks when we first went. So I was still getting to know her. And that was the moment though that I fell in love with Jamie because it was just this magic and the sparkle in her eye and I knew she had such a special spirit about her. And so, I just love you so much. All right, I'm gonna go get your gift, not cry. When the Mandalorian was coming out and Baby Yoda, Baby Grogu, every time a new episode would come out before I would watch the episode, she would tell me about all the parts of Grogu and that's because that was one of my favorite characters too. So she was always giving me sneak peeks and it was so fun to hear her talk about that. This is cute, mom. You like it? I like it. And she has a change of clothes. We got her little pajamas. Onesie. A little onesie. And then her normal jacket. What does the shirt on the but Baby Yoda say, Jamie? Maybe sister. Maybe try pushing the button and see if it talks. We can't wait for the joyous moment when you officially become a pet on January 24th of 2024. Mom. What did she say? <laughs> 2024, I'm going to change my middle last name. I know. You make up a pet and make her last name. Oh, what's your soul saying? Oh, is your world changing? Oh, I love you so much. I love you too. Normally, when 
go to Build-A-Bear, the bear gets the birth certificate, but this is technically your new birth certificate because it says January 24th, 2024. Yeah. That's Jamie. Picking her up from church school, yeah. Oh yeah, and you guys had time to ride in the car and talk together? Yeah. I love that. Yeah, he got a strawberry good. on his white shirt that he needed to wear. It's not gonna block. No, no. The Logan, block. you gotta change your shirt. Hey, Savannah saves the day. Thank you. Okay, clean it in the car, let's go. Do not use what a tight stick. What is this? You have to just do this. Oh wait, hold on. I have to. Okay, I'll do, I'll do. Hold on, I have to squeeze out. Okay. And then you just rub it. Hold on, we got to do it in the car. We got to go. Yeah, it's in the steam. Here, we're good. No, no, we have to tight stick it. We're good. We don't need the luggage. Use a tight stick to get the stain off. And it, it was worked. Small. It, it worked. Was small. Now you have no stain, and your shirt small looks good. Line. Tight stick to the rescue! Arwen, what do you play? Percussion. She does percussion. And Logan, what do you do? Tuba. Tuba. Yeah. Field trip though? Yeah. What's your favorite memory with Jamie? Did you hear she got a date to change her name? No. January 24th. Ah. Wait, she changed her name? Yeah. Well, her last name. Oh, I was, like, I was like, huh? Gotta be a pettit. Woo woo. My favorite memory. Sorry, I put you on the spot. No, you're good. I just haven't really thought about it. I'm gonna have to think about that one. I'll get back to Mine you. was Disneyland. Cause she gets so excited. Yeah, it's she so did. Sweet. Oh, mine was probably the corn maze. Oh yeah. Because she was, she bragged so much that she wasn't scared. She loves scary movies, and the entire time she's gripping onto my arm, bear hugging my arms, Aww. terrified. And it was just hilarious. And the last scene, there's one of the scenes where the guy comes out of the corn maze. It's not a real chainsaw. But he comes out and he has a fake chainsaw and he runs at you. My scared self booked it and Jamie was behind me and I left her. And you hear Jamie, ah! it, it, it was hilarious. <laughs> the corn maze. Because she bragged how much she wouldn't get scared because she watches scary movies. And then she was terrified. It was great. That's funny. All right. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Her reaction was so sweet. Oh. But I can't wait for January 24th now. now. Everyone's going to be a pet. Pet it! Me pet the pet it palace. You're grows. a pet it, huh? Bell. The pet it family grows. Well, Arwen will be the last one. The pet it palace grows. Our kingdom is gro growing. Yeah, I don't know where I was going. <laughs> we'll see you all next time. Bye. <laughs>